Responsible investment is any activity uh, within institutional investment, particularly mainstream institutional investment, that takes into account environmental, social, corporate governance issues uh, in the investment processes. People have now come to understand that the so-called extra financial issues actually do have a serious impact on long-term investments. That understanding was not always there. And I think also the legal framework has actually changed in many uh, uh, jurisdictions, including uh, within the countries of Europe, for example. There is now a much broader uh, understanding as to what fiduciary responsibility actually means. For us, responsibility um, uh, in terms of the, the, the partnerships that we pursued with the financial sector um, in, entails a notion of really responding to stakeholder expectations and needs. Uh, the notion of shifting from a from a stockholder only orientation to a stakeholder orientation. Companies recognizing their responsibilities with respect to a range of constituencies. Investors certainly, um, but equally communities, uh, employees, um, uh, business partners, uh, local government, uh, and more broadly speaking, civil society. From our point of view, as pension funds and as institutional investors, we want to ensure that the, our investments um, are, are enhanced to the maximum extent in a responsible manner without entailing, without doing harm to the rest of the world or putting our own investments at risk. I should add that the issues that we're confronting today in the world, uh, be they related to climate change, water, uh, corruption, um, are really health. Uh, are really too large and complex for any one sector alone to solve. There are governance gaps, and therefore there's a great need for stakeholders to collaborate collectively on these issues. So we see corporate responsibility as being the notion of embedding principles and values in business operations, both because it's in their enlightened self-interest, but also because it's part of addressing global governance gaps in order to produce a more sustainable planet and sustainable uh, global economy uh, that's inclusive uh, for all. The core philosophy behind responsible investment uh, as defined by the principles for responsible investment are those activities that will add to long-term value for the shareholders, uh, particularly through building better companies over the long term. This is about materiality, not about morality. Um, so really, the, the real driver for P PRI and responsible investment ultimately has to be materiality. There are, of course, many signatories to PRI who will take an ethical um, stance. Uh, for example, if you're an organisation of heart surgeons, it's highly unlikely you would want to invest in tobacco companies, for example, unless you wanted to be perhaps uh, preserve long-term employment uh, for heart surgeons. Um, so there are organisations that will take an ethical uh, stance on particular products and particular uh, commodities and, and particular equities. But basically responsible investment is actually much greater than simply an ethical issue. It's about how we exercise ownership and how we integrate uh, those environmental, the social and the governance issues into the investment process.